Welcome to Legality, an eSign eStampin document workflow platform. In this video, we will show you how to create a template using the Legality template engine and how to send a templatized document for eSigning. Sign into Legality. You can create and store templates useful for standard form of documents and agreements with variable fields. Once a template is created and saved, it can be used to create a finalized document and sent for e-signing in just a few clicks. The first part of the video will cover how to create a template. From the workstations, click on Templates. To create a template, click on the New Template button. You will be taken to the Legality Template Processor, a basic word processor on which you can organize your templates. Enter the document name, that is, the name you want to give the template. This first ribbon on top allows you to customize the variable fields in the template. The second and the third ribbon are basic formatting features to format the document like that in a Microsoft Word. To start making a template, Paste the contents of your template in the Legality Template Processor. The Text Field button creates variable text boxes for smaller details such as name, age, etc. Configure the name of the text field and add a placeholder denoting the input value. Checking the required option makes it a compulsory field. Insert Image option creates a variable field that requires uploading of an image. Enter the values of the field and check the required box. We are adding another text field option here with the value of age. Next is the radio button feature. This allows you to create fields under which only one option can be selected from a list of options for that particular field. This option allows you to group the field under one head. For example, in this we are asking for the gender details. Next is the text area button. This helps you create boxes for text bodies that require more space such as paragraphs, address, etc. We are adding another text field option here with a placeholder value for phone number. The checkbox field. This can be used where the user can choose from multiple options out of a set of options for a particular category. For example, here we are asking for the preferred city of the train. Enter the name of the field and a value for the placeholder. Click the required box and repeat this action for the number of options you want to provide in the template. Next is the selection field. This is used where the user has to choose one option from the list of options in the same category. It works like a drop down menu function. For example, here we are asking the trainee to select the state they belong from. Enter the text and the value and then click on add button. Repeat this for the number of options you want to provide in the drop down menu and then click on OK. Our 
After you are done creating the template, you can preview the template and click on save. You can fill in the variable fields in the preview window to check how the template feature would work at the end user's part. Click on template to view the recently created template. The help button at the top of the legality template processor acts as a quick reference guide while creating a template. 